Harry Redknapp found fame after a hugely successful professional footballer career and then went on to manage some of the biggest clubs in the Premier League. However, the 77-year-old is a family man at heart and often credits his wife Sandra as the person he couldn't live without. Back in 1966, the Londoner signed for West Ham and then managed the likes of Portsmouth. He led them to their FA Cup final win in 2008 and took Tottenham Hotspur from relegation to UEFA Champions League qualification. Over the years he has rubbed shoulders with some of the biggest sporting legends to date. In 2018 fans saw a different side to the Cockney when he entered ITV's popular reality show I'm a Celebrity, Get Me Out of Here, and went without food for four days. He was often heard hailing his wife, 75, whom he married back in 1967. The couple moved to Dorset several years ago after enjoying the slower pace of life in a sprawling mansion. They have two grown-up sons, Jamie, who followed in his father's footsteps, and Mark. He told The Guardian that his biggest fear in life is, something happening to Sandra. He also confessed that his happiest memory is when he met his now wife of 57 years and went on to spend most of their lives together. He gushed, when I met, my wife, Sandra, I was coming up 17. We met at the Two Puddings, a dance hall in Stratford. The pair are very close and Sandra is often spotted accompanying him to various events as well as taking out their grandchildren on family days out. When he appeared on the Jungle reality show, she even flew halfway across the world to be with him, and even surprised him in a secret task. At the time Harry was seen bursting into floods of tears after missing her so much. However, a second love in Harry's life is his love of horses. The racing enthusiast last month the star headed to Cheltenham and this weekend will be watching the Grand National. Although his dream may have to wait for another year after his superstar horse was declared for a different race. But the football icon could still walk away from Aintree £140,000 better off on Ladies' Day. Initially, he hoped his Ben Pauling trained chaser would go for the main race worth £500,000 to the winner, this Saturday. But the horse has officially been declared for Friday's Topham Handicap Chase on Ladies' Day instead.